Alright guys, this is it man, we're going to the final area, and yes, this is going to be, probably be the last recording section of Earthbound, which is kind of sad. I'm not sure this is going to be my first one that I do, but I have two others, actually I, well, two are just with Phil, so. Yara! Yeah, the Saturns are incredible folk, and the Apple Kid, he is the most expendable young man, very different from other kids. Well, anyway, the prototype face disorder has been stolen. Someone resembling a pig wearing Mr. Wearing clothes took Mr. Saturn captive. It's still a device. A pig guy who looks like a pig, huh? Okay, I didn't even talk to him again. Let's talk to the applicant. Excellent, excellent. Everything has proceeded as planned. Dr. Anderson and Mr. Saturn have worked together and finally completed the face disorder. The purpose of the device is, is to enable and. In, 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 and I can't read that word through, and travel through space and time. So basically, saying that the pink can go through space and time. So yes, we can actually take this and we can try it, but uh, well, it uh, doesn't really seem to work. <laughs> I like how we came out like that. I, I will admit, even though it's kind of annoying when you're trying to travel, uh, it's kind of a final animation they did there. Um, hmm, that doesn't work. Well, one thing is missing, but that hmm, material cannot be normally found on the Earth. The material I'm thinking of came from a meteorite when the young feller, when I was in younger. You have seen a meteorite recently. Eureka! That's it. We so yes. So yes, we have to go back to one at. Uh, I'm not gonna read all that. So yes, we have to go back to one at, and we get to go back to that meteorite from the start of the game. I think that's really cool. How you know you have to go back to. Uh, the first area of the game, like, you know, before you go to the final boss, you go back to where you start and you just kind of realize how strong and more powerful you become ever since, you know, you left, uh, like, where you started. Like, you started off there. And, whoa, this place looks like three back when they had zombies everywhere, man. This doesn't look good. When it's kind of messed up right now. Probably should go back and check on my mom. My mummy. Let's fight this guy. Let's see what enemies they got here now. The ghost of Saturn. Oh, is that the ghost of that dude I beat? Oh, come on, Zim. Really? Like, my final recording session, you seriously just want to miss? And I'm already getting wrecked. Wow, that's just a great sign of things to come. Yes, he was defeated, thank goodness. Man, we really gotta get more leveled up. Oh, Emily's. Wow, I know. I say that we actually level up. All right, let's uh, let's see. How, let's see. How, uh, yeah, let's um, let's do a PSI. Let's do lift, and we'll do one on Emily first. And with HP is maxed out, I'm gonna do it again on Bob. Phil seems to be fine for now, so let's just keep going. Let's head back to my home, my little house. The House on the Prairie. It's a reference to a film. Say, so, oh, I'm not fighting that thing. Those things blow up. Oh, good job. I'm dodging that quickly. Oh, come on, dude. Run away. Come on. Oh, thank goodness he ran away. I'm not going to fight guys. I'm going to blow up on me, man. Actually, let's go back in the house and see what my mama's doing. How the mom is doing. It's so dark in here now. Oh, Zim, you finally showed up. There were plenty of creepy monsters running around when it uh, town. The town people are barricaded in their homes, afraid to go out. I'm fine, but I'm a bit scared. You, everything will be okay, though, just sitting quietly in the dark. Are you hungry? You want some pizza? I think Lena actually uh, healed us all up. Yep, we're all good to go. Let's keep going. You gotta go back to the meteorite. And whoa! Oh my god! Jesus! Oh, of course you would use a star storm thing. Oh my god, these guys! I don't care, hopefully this will kill all of them. Please kill them all. Oh, 
Oh, wait, those things don't blow up. <laughs> now I gotta resurrect Emily and Bob. No, Phil's level 59. Nice, he's getting up there. He's uh, getting up there, man. Let's do Emily. And let's uh, do uh, Bob. And I'm gonna do PSI. And this has got me a lot of. Actually, I actually have a lot of BP, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, we got a sneak attack. Nice. Alright, let's get this guy. This guy should be easy to take down. Nice job. Oh, he became tame. Yeah! Let's keep going. We're almost in the meteor, right? And this guy won't back to blow up on me. Thank goodness. Oh, you dot. How can you dodge yourself? You're a freaking circle, man. Huh, I kind of steal something, yeah. You're basically a shy guy now from Super Mario Brothers. You just try to steal stuff. I'm on level 80? Holy crap, that's... Wow. And yes, level 100 is the highest you can get in this game. All oh, these two things again. And like PSI freeze alpha on him. Just have everybody tackle him. Now he's the stronger, more threatening of the group. Uh, hopefully this will kill both of them. Yep, I defeated the ghost of Starman. Huh, I get to use Thunder. So that'd be stupid eye thing on our hands. Again, I do like the enemy designs, they're pretty cool in this game. Yeah, I still love this game, you know, yeah, I did kind of rage a lot. I still like the game a lot. It's, it's, I still really recommend the game if you really like RPGs and stuff. Uh, I mean, this game just, you know, has a good charm to it, you know? You know, I'm just gonna be lazy and do PSI start alpha. Just because it doesn't kill him. And like do another PSI freeze on him. And then Bob would really just attack him. It does so much damage, man. It like freaking destroys them all. It's like a one hit KO, man. It costs so much BP and stuff. Bob's a level 65, nice. All right, let's keep going up here. Almost up the hill. Oh, oh! I forgot to show you guys this. If I was, uh, I forgot to show you guys this. But in the, in that, um, you know that dream part we were in. Uh, I was gonna show you guys this. Um, you actually can see Buzz Buzz there. He's actually in the dream sequence, and he's like, "Hi, I'm, I was at the start of the game." I thought was kind of funny because it's like, oh, we haven't seen him. Yeah, he died back in like part one of this Let's Play, I believe. Wow, that guy must have a lot of HP if he survives that. Holy cow. Oh, hey, there's that place where that really weird guy was, that weird pedophile guy was. I'm pretty sure he's a pedophile. You know, the guy from the guy that tried to kill us back in the tune uh, in the Happy Happy Village. Let's try and grab in the meteorite. Alright guys, now we're gonna head back. Now we get to head back uh, to Saturn Valley. Here we are back in Saturn Valley. I'm gonna rest. Nah, I'll just give the thing to Dr. Anna that's quick. Hmm, if I find a piece of the meteor, I might be able to interrupt some Zachion. Oh wait, Zim go down here, meteor piece. 
Yes, that is fantastic. What? Well, I've never actually seen this incredibly rare element before. It's very fascinating. Yeah, so he's telling you to get some rest, and I'm gonna buy some items and stuff probably before I head out. Cause when you go on that machine, you're heading out to the final boss. That's right, you're heading out to fight the final boss. Yes, we're going to the final area. I think on the I stated this will be the last recording session, so it's kind of obvious that this would be the final boss. Yeah. Talk to him again. Finally, it's complete! The face disorder version 2! It's equipped with two new features first. It can repair your... Oh, I don't really need this. But yeah, that thing can actually save your uh, progress. Yeah, I should probably... Yeah, I'll get my preparations ready, and then we're gonna head out. And I love Mr. Saturn. I love Saturn Valley. It's probably my favorite area of the game. That and Fortnite are the two best areas of this game. Okay, let's check this thing. Okay, one, two. Let's get seven. Uh. Alright, now let's go buy some stuff from this guy. Oh, wait, you don't have a... Oh, you don't have any items I can buy to heal myself? Oh, here we go. Ooh, a flame pendant, nice. Ah. Shoot, I was hoping I could buy some items. Let me try that one dude. If not, I guess I have to go out there. Oh, Horn of Life, yes. Uh... Then a horn of life. I'll get that to fill. Also, I'm gonna buy. I think I'm gonna buy a uh, refreshing her. Yeah, yep. Yeah, gotta love Mr. Saturn. All right, guys. So now we're heading out to the final area of the game. And no, you cannot come back. Uh, when you go there. And by the way, the last area is one of the scariest levels in gaming history to me, for me, honestly. I, I've still kind of creeped out by it. Good, at last, the time has come. Are you ready? Oh, we already had to talk with him. Oh, okay, he's just saying get in. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna just get right in the circle quite there. Let's get in, let's try this again, shall we? Oh hey, it actually worked! Kinda. This dude again? Greetings! So you are finally here! Excellent! You are truly excellent! This is the one last time I'll give you the last power. I must go now. Oh, nice, he gave Phil, uh, his new Starman power. Let's talk to you. Kidnapped, I was pulling. Kidnapped! Bye, guy! Bye, guy! Gone! Zoom! Where to the past? Ding dong! So, yeah, there's something really else you can really do here. Yeah, but then Dr. Ananuts appears again. The fate of this order has been completed. We could finish this quickly because Mr. Saturn's incredible scientific skill. Guy guys is attacking us from an from an exact location. They attacking us for many years in the past. This is really hard to tell you, but gotta keep talking to him. Yeah, and he goes. You must go back into the past. 
Oh, there you go. Now it works. Sorry, I couldn't figure it out quite there. Yeah, he goes over here and he talks to him. In order to defeat Guy, guys, who who's attacking us from the past, you must warp to the past. This can be done. This can be done by the way of the Fades Disorder Three. However, the machine cannot warp li living things. Meaning, I mean, life forms. So how did you get here? Life is demolished in the process of warping. The only way to accomplish this time travel is to transfer your brain program into a robot and send the robot to the past. The transfer means that your spirit will go with the robot while your body is left behind. I cannot promise that your spirit will come back after the battle of the past. Yet, you must understand that the four of you are the chosen ones. Do you still wish to fight Gygas and travel to the past? Yes. I'll do anything to kill Gygas now. I just want to kill him so we can sit, uh, finally have this game be over. Uh, not to give him my cat. So yeah, he's uh, switching our brains into a robot. Oh, I would not want to be. <laughs> I would not want to be them right now. I think I wouldn't want to go. I think I wouldn't mind going on this cool adventure with you know psychic powers. But man, I have to transfer my brain, like, dude. Yeah, it's good. I'm eating McDonald's, by the way. Yep. Yep, yep. Oh, thank you, Dr. Anderson, for me feeling it was an honor to be here with us. Here we go, guys. Going back in time. I think a thousand years into the past to fight guy, I guess. And, uh... Yeah, here we are. This is one of the t scariest levels in gaming history, to me, honestly. But I'll see you guys next time.